All right, guys, we're day two here at Iron Horse Mud Ranch. Yesterday was pretty sick. We had to bog a little bit, get through some tug of wars. Everybody was freaking excited. We had bounty hold going on. Awesome time. So at this point, we're going to watch some freestyle, and then we are freaking bogging, guys. Never lifting. Check it out. Hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs>
All right, guys, so the rest of this video is us bogging. We got more bogging going on, a lot of times getting stuck, a lot of times getting pulled out, but straight mud bogging until we have a little issue. So you guys have to check that out. Don't forget to go on to baldeagle.com or cleusmcfarland.com. Grab you some JVC so merchandise. Guys, by popular demand, your boyfriend blocks the diesel pump shirts are back in stock. We got those shirts back in stock. There's a limited quantity and a limited time they'll be in stock. So check them out, guys. Hop up on the website, snag you some of those. They are ready to rip, guys. You guys want them back, so we brought them back. Thank you guys again, and enjoy the video today.
but I don't know, bud. That's a deep hole. They have a meeting of the minds, a powwow as they call it. Trying to get together as a tribe here and see what the best option is. What do you think the best option is? What do I think of this? So what do you think the best option for this is? The best option is for this guy to get out of the way. This guy, you mean this yeah. guy here? He's on the team, but you know, he's out there. <laughs> Carlos just needs to hook up to all of them and just yank them out of the All at one time. All, one, all at once. All at once. Yeah. Unlimited horsepower. Oh, yeah, I seen it. I mean, he drove through that hole like, like, it, it, wasn't like it wasn't nothing. I don't know what's going on with these other guys here. They just don't have it, but you know what? If you Justin, look. Justin just let off the if gas. If you look, soon. he's got that shirt on. It says EGTs are just a number. Yeah, baby. He knows. He knows where it's at. He knows, he knows. Truck's pretty cool. It's a new build. The guy lives in Louisiana, I believe. He's out of Louisiana. It's got hybrid axles in it. They're like, Mer uh, like uh, Unimog axles. They come way up in the center. Pretty, pretty cool build. And he goes like nothing. You get in these big holes and it starts getting the axles high centered, it's tough to really do too much. When tires aren't on anything solid, it's hard to make them go anywhere. There's some deep holes out here. Now Carlos is going back up with Justin. Then we can resume normal mud bogging. All righty, they got it all figured out. to come out pretty easy. He's not stuck real bad.
can see here, just your typical recovery. Nothing to be seen at all. Get this thing back out and get her hitting all the cylinders again. Back across the deep stuff. Easy peasy, nothing to it. There we go. on the backside of all them trucks and I there's not much I can do about it I can't see some hard bogging. I think we hurt the trans. We uh we lost forward. We lost forward gears. We got a lot of fluid dumping out. I don't know, but it already did this to us last night and then it worked. So we'll see what it does. We'll let it cool down. Got a little warm. It's like 2:30. Let it cool down. Maybe the seal will shrink back up and be fine. Or not. The oh. good news is it's that's not good. Hit it harder. 
Oh my god. Oh, so much for that. Yeah, so, but all in all, she's bargain, dude. She's, uh, she's painted on pretty good after this event. She's winging. I think we're finally getting her dialed in. All right, so it's coming along good. Getting good. All right, let's see what we can do to finish the day out. All right, guys, we're loading up for my horse mud ranch. Lost my voice. It's here. It's going to stay with the park for a few days. But all in all, it's good time. we had a great time. The place is awesome. I mean, we haven't been for like six or seven years. And I mean, it's honestly an epic park. They did a lot with this place. Very cool. Lots to do. Um, the truck did really well until we had an issue with the transmission. So we lost forward gears. It still moves, but it slips really bad. But you know, you should never be able to tell what color your truck is after leaving the mud hole. Unless the tailgate. That's about the only spot that should be clean. But she's freaking covered, dude. Oh, dang. Mud was good. Truck was running well. Had a little mechanical issue, which partly was our fault, my fault. I got a little warm a couple times and, uh, you know, had to deal with that. So. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching today's social channel. We will see you next time.